slight change of plans, guys. Um, <laughs> I was cutting the piece that goes into here down to size. And <coughs> the, the bandsaw kicked the piece of metal. It, it bit it and it threw my thumb into the blade. Uh, about from there to about the middle of my thumb all the way across right down the middle well not down the middle but like up near my fingernail it gashed I'll put a picture of it um, viewer discretion it's not very bloody but there is quite a bit of blood so here's the picture right here uh, it's not terrible bad it does hurt like a mother right now because it's got a lot of cleaning solution in it because the bandsaw blade was very not clean so there's that um, I seem to have misplaced the piece of metal but I'm gonna go find it and I'm gonna finish this gimped up thumb or not uh, I didn't quite get I got it cut to length but the piece that goes into the cylinder is still a little bit longer but if I open up the um, the gate to the, the loading gate uh, excuse me I can still make it work so I'm gonna get it stick it in there and we're gonna see what the gun looks like All right. thanks for watching I'll catch you guys here in just a little bit. Okay, I've got the piece of metal. I found it. I cut it to length. And that cut right there is what I was trying to do. I don't know if you can see that. I cut right there in that little loop, that little notch. And this is oddly shaved and bent. So I was trying to hold it. And it yanked the blade yank this down and thumb got in the way but okay that is that right there got the revolver right here now I have to lo open up the loading gate I'm a cylinder. And that is pretty much it right there. I might cut it a little bit lower uh, later. Not right now. Can you guys see that? Right there. <clears throat> see out from this side what's going on it goes through the cylinder and it pokes it right there and I was cutting that little nub off so it would fit down through but right there it is the revolver and all of its beauty now I can go ahead and take this zip tie off to, you know, this is not gonna be part of it anymore because I'm not, I'm just, it's gonna be a more mantelpiece, so I'm gonna take the zip tie off somehow. <clears throat> uh, I got an idea. Uh, I think power tools and me aren't gonna get along today, but I'm gonna try one more.
guys think I'm gonna have my uncle's initials car or uh, I'm gonna use a soldering gun to burn his initials into this side and then sometime down the line maybe not today but I'm gonna uh, burn my initials into the other side I might put something right in here or right in here like a brass tag um, We'll just have to see, but the final product, how to, how I made the grip scales, kind of sort of refined them, and hope you guys enjoyed, I'll catch you guys in the next video.